Sometimes it's the simple, affordable, and cordless gadgets that add that little bit extra to our reefs that our corals really end up appreciating. And the spin stream definitely falls into that category of gadgets. Getting the right kind of flow in our reef tanks is one of the major components to success, especially with our corals. We strive to find the right combination of pumps with just the right settings to create wide, massive, and random flow throughout the tank, but our return nozzles from our filtration system are often pretty basic, pumping water in a single direction. Innovative Marine's Spin Stream is a great little device that adds a wider and more randomized flow pattern to your aquarium's return nozzle, the outlet of a canister filter, or even just a standard power head. Using the force of the pump, water passes by a propeller attached to a set of gears, which turns a 40 degree angled nozzle a full 360 degrees, changing the trajectory of the water flow continuously to create a more natural and varied flow pattern throughout the aquarium, all without using any electricity. So let's get a closer look, go over what tanks and gear it's gonna fit, see how it performs, and then take it apart, cause why not? When you open up the box, you'll find the spin stream as well as three cut to fit rubber adapters. The spin stream is compact, sitting right around two and three quarters of an inch long, one and a half inches wide and two inches tall, and is designed for flow rates between 52 and 600 gallons per hour. It can easily adapt to flow nozzles and outflow pipes that are half inch, five eighths inch, and three quarter inch using those various cut to fit rubber adapters, meaning not only can you use it on innovative marine aquariums, but also any aquarium filter or pump in that size range. Installing the spin stream is a piece of cake. First, find the adapter that snugly fits the outlet of your pump or aquarium, cut it down to fit the length perfectly, and then slip it on. As soon as the water flow is turned on, it'll automatically start spinning, and the pace of the spin will depend on the flow rate of the pump. The lower the flow rate, the slower the spin, and inversely, higher flow rates will make it spin faster. The only trade-off is the added head pressure and the appropriate decrease in overall flow rate since it is using the force of the water to generate that motion, but how quickly it spins isn't all that important since it'll be creating a much wider and more random flow pattern than a stationary outlet would either way. When you first start using the spin stream, you'll likely be able to hear the gears quietly turning, but after 24 to 48 hours, they break in and they become practically silent, which is perfect. If you do find that your spin stream starts to get noisier again over time, it usually just means that it's due for some simple maintenance. The good news is the spin stream comes completely apart, so you can give it a thorough cleaning, and there are only three moving parts inside, so it's really easy to reassemble. If you clean it frequently, you may not need to take it apart very often and instead can just give it a citric acid bath to remove any calcareous buildup, followed by a thorough rinsing. But it is fantastic to know that it can be completely disassembled so you can get right in there. After it's all shiny and new, you can slip it back onto the nozzle and it'll go right back to work creating that wider oscillating flow, which you can implement on your own tank by clicking right here.